Crafting Minds presents Curious About Orthographic Mapping. If you work in education, you may have heard of the term orthographic mapping, but weren't quite sure what it meant or how it was applicable to your instruction. Orthographic mapping is the process by which we store words for instant recognition, and it facilitates our sight word knowledge. You may not have known this, but sight words are like the MVP of the reading process. Because reading is our primary tool for learning most new content, the act of reading has to be really fast and automatic. In fact, word reading happens in milliseconds, so we can't spend our time decoding. Rather, we have to recognize most words by sight. This paragraph from a New York Times article has 83 words, and the average adult reader would read it in less than 30 seconds, and you probably would only have to decode two words. That's the power of sight word knowledge. How do we develop our sight word knowledge? Well, it's not what you might think. Our sight word ability relies more on our phonemic awareness skills than on our visual memory. Sight word recognition is the result of skill development in three main areas, sound symbol correspondence, word study or recognizing common letter patterns, and proficiency in higher level phonemic awareness skills. Together, these facilitate orthographic mapping. Just to review, all of those readers who can instantly recognize these words by sight have very strong skills in phonemic awareness. That means the readers can segment or break apart sounds, delete or substitute sounds, and blend the sounds back together. And the key to orthographic mapping is being able to do all of this automatically. So let's imagine that you're working with a struggling reader who's had a really hard time recognizing common words repeatedly. It might be that they need phonemic awareness instruction, and it doesn't matter if they're a young child or a teenager. Next steps you can take as an educator include assessing higher level phonemic awareness skills. You can use the Phonological Awareness Screening Test or PASS by David Kilpatrick to do this. You can also enhance your word study work by focusing on common patterns like rhyme patterns, root words, and affixes. A fantastic resource to add to your library is Equipped for Reading Success by David Kilpatrick, which not only includes the assessment tool of the past, but also targeted activities for building advanced phonemic awareness skills. For more information about orthographic mapping, including online courses and blog posts, visit our website at www.craftingmindsgroup.com.